Chamber of Commerce members, volunteers, and several people all over the Grand Strand are gathering this morning to say thank you to local police officers. ABC 15's Amanda Kenseth is live this morning at the Myrtle Beach Police Department with more info. Good morning. Good morning, that's right. Yeah, and Cindy and I are getting all the goodies ready, right? We are getting all the goodies <laughs> ready. So we're, we're setting up the breakfast. It starts in less than an hour now. Yes, it does. And Absolutely. talk about why you guys are doing this. Well, this was an idea that our chamber ambassadors came up with. They wanted to do something to thank all the police officers for protecting not only the residents, but our visitors here in Myrtle Beach. And so we are doing breakfast all this week. And actually, we're going to be doing breakfast all through the end of the summer. Right, yeah. To thank our police officers. Throughout the week. And who doesn't love food? I mean, that's a great Absolutely. way to say thank you. Breakfast in the morning. And, and then we've got, we, we stole the goodie bag just to see what all, what all we have. My personal favorite so far is this chocolate badges. Who doesn't like chocolate? Yeah. Like a badge, right, right? very cool. I don't think they'll wear it. I think they're gonna eat it. Yeah, Probably pretty quickly, yeah. And we have, hey, hey. All right, ABC 15. <laughs> WPDE is our co-sponsor of this event, and we have all kinds of great sponsors. Our chamber members that came out, jumped on board, wanted to help provide breakfast, so we're very appreciative. Yeah, well, when you think about what you know, all officers do to help the community, um, and then we've got the blinky lights, which is Button. awesome. I'm gonna have yep. to get one of these. Up. And this is so cute. So a daycare, Palmetto Preschool, made all these little thank you cards to show appreciation. They, they have made <laughs> probably well over a hundred of these for all the police officers, so it was very sweet. Very, very sweet, and uh, what a great day for officers and to show our appreciation, guys. Very cool. And then the next time we see her, the breakfast will almost be starting because it kicks off there at 5.30 uh, this morning. Or actually, it starts in five minutes. I'm thinking of another one. That's at the Myrtle Beach Police Department on North Oak Street. And you can also check out the Surfside Beach one, 7.30 to 9.30 on Pine Drive. We'll be live from North Myrtle Beach tomorrow morning. This is going on all week. Thanking police officers for all they do to protect our community. A breakfast starts in just a few minutes, or it started a few minutes ago, right? Yes, just in now Myrtle started. Beach for local law enforcement. ABC 15's Amanda Kinseth is live at the Myrtle Beach Police Department to explain. That's right, yeah, and you can uh, take a look at what's happening back here. Everything's getting set up, and you've got area chamber members from the Myrtle Beach Area Chamber of Commerce, and then a lot of businesses, too, are coming together, setting up. Cookie Monster is over there even. I did not know he was going to make an appearance, but that means probably if there's any cookies here, they're going to be gone. But I've got Martin from Monarch and Alex from FSA, and you guys are two of the sponsors. And talk about why you do this and why you're giving back to police officers. Well, we have a very unique opportunity. I feel like uh, Myrtle Beach is a growing uh, area and, and we have a lot of opportunities for all of us. But to uh, give back to uh, the police officers, uh, those that keep us safe, keep us a uh, beautiful Myrtle Beach uh, safe for all of us. Is, uh, it's an honor to be here today and, and to uh, uh, honor the, the men and women in service. So small token for what they do. Absolutely. And I know, I mean, FSA, you guys, you know, both of your companies are always trying to give back to the community and do what you can. Oh, yeah. That's the one thing we love to do is giving back to the community, especially to our first responders. They're in and out every day, putting their lives on the line to make Myrtle Beach, you know, one of the best tourist areas in the United States. And we, we love Myrtle Beach and just being able to give back is it, it's truly a blessing to see how much they actually put into the community. Yeah, one of the best tourist areas and one of the best places to live, I think. I mean, this place is amazing. And do we know what's on the menu yet? What are we having for breakfast? Ooh, I see a lot of good stuff here. So, uh, <laughs> but uh, this is going on today, right now in Myrtle Beach, later on in Surfside, tomorrow, uh, other precincts and departments. So uh, saying thank you with food, a great way to do that. Thank you, Amanda. What a great event. Yes, I know that's the way to your heart, so I'm sure <laughs> to theirs as well. This morning's events are being held right there at the Myrtle Beach Police Department on North Oak Street until 730. And then one's being held at the Surfside Beach Police Station on Pine Drive this morning from 730 until 930. Chamber of Commerce members and volunteers from all over our area are gathering right now to say thank you to local police. It's a great event. ABC 15's Amanda Kenseth is live this morning at the Myrtle Beach Police Department. Good morning. 
Good morning. That's right. Yeah, you just missed the big rush of uh, police officers coming through, grabbing some breakfast. It's kind of a grab and go thing yeah, because yes. you know they have jobs to they do. Have jobs they have to get going. Some of them it. are actually getting off and going home and going to sleep. So I know we're, <laughs> we're excited to, to help them too to so, be able to grab some breakfast and go home. Right, right. The shift change is either yeah. the end of their day or the start of their work day. Yes, yeah, but yes. they've all been real appreciative too. I mean. Yeah. Who better say thank you than food, right? Right, exactly. <laughs> Everybody loves food. And, of course, we have Chick-fil-A here, and we have donuts, coffee, water, orange juice. Uh, so, of course, the officers are loving it. It's just one little way that we can give back and say thank you. Sure. Well, the Murder Beach Area Chamber of Commerce and uh, all the area chambers came together, and businesses are coming together all to show the support for the officers. And yes. then children yes. came together yes. and made the cutest little thank you cards and you have what hundreds yeah that we had a few hundred of these my my son's daycare of palmetto learning center they all did little thank you cards to our police officers it's so cute i was so thankful that they were able to do this for us and and the kids not only did they do thank you cards they got to learn a little bit about what our police officers do for our community so it, it was just so great it was so cute too some of the little cards were saying they protect us from bad guys and they're my superheroes so you love to read stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. They used to say thank you for protecting us. And yes. They went all out with the little phone. They and the, did. The awesome they little did. Stickers it right was there. so great. Yeah, our, our daycare is, is wonderful with, with helping um, you know give back a little bit and having the kids provide that for the police officers. Well, you know, and we were just talking to an officer earlier who said, you know, the kids remind us why we do this. It's yes. when they come up and give the high fives yes. and give the thank yous for protecting us. And yes. Speaking of high fives, we got to give Cookie Monster, Cookie Monster over here a high five. <laughs> Have you had any cookies yet? <laughs> yeah. Full belly of cookies. <laughs> and today the officers get a full belly of breakfast. Guys. Hey, nothing like a homemade card, right? Those were nice. True, that was beautiful. This morning's event is being held right there at the Myrtle Beach PD on North Oak Street until about 7.30 for another hour. And one is also being held at the Surfside Beach Police Station on Pine Drive this morning. That's from 7.30 to 9.30. Thanking police officers for all they do to protect our community. A breakfast is, is happening right now in Myrtle Beach for local law enforcement. ABC 15's Amanda Kinseth is there live this morning at the Myrtle Beach Police Department to explain. Manister now with the uh, Myrtle Beach Police Department. So what do you think? You've got breakfast today. I think it's great. Everybody's coming out. We're having a great time. Uh, it's good to kind of hang out and meet everybody. And just, it's, it's terrific. I think it's wonderful. Uh, what did you pick up this morning? I got a Chick-fil-A biscuit and our shoes. All right. Of course, we got plenty of other goodies. It's, it's, good, it's good stuff. It's good experience. And how do you feel about, you know, people coming out and saying, hey, thank you. I mean, I want to say thank you. Thank all of you guys well, for what you do. I appreciate it. I think it's great. It's always good that uh, to meet a lot of people in the community that do support us on a regular basis. There's a lot of people out there that do. And sometimes in our line of work, we don't get told it enough, but stuff like this makes up for it. It's fantastic. Yeah, and uh, you can use some ciders. We also invited the fire fighters over, I think they did. Yep, they but showed up a second ago. don't tell anybody, but, right? Uh, Have they gotten here yet? Uh, they showed up for a minute. I think they went to go get reinforcements when they saw what we had going on. So. <laughs> um, but, you know, being a police officer, why do you do it? Um, I love what I do. It's a lot of fun. I get to meet different people from all over the country, all over the world. Um, we get to have a little bit of impact on their days. Usually when people see us, it's a bad day. It doesn't matter what happened or why we're there. But if I can do just one little thing to make that day a little bit better and give them a better experience in the city and just with law enforcement and the community, it's worth every minute. Yeah, well, we showed the cards earlier from kids, you know, thank you for protecting us. And, you know, that's what you guys do, and that's why you're here. So that's why we're here. And actually, they're going to feed you every Wednesday now. That sounds awesome. Every Wednesday in the summer. Sounds breakfast fantastic. for officers. I'm not going to argue with that. And we say thank you as well. Yes, well deserved. This morning's event is being held right there at the Myrtle Beach PD on North Oak Street until 7.30. Another one is also being held at the Surfside Beach Police Station on Pine Drive this morning from 7.30 to 9.30. Also, you should know we're going to be live tomorrow morning from North Myrtle Beach where more breakfasts are being held. It's a whole week event. Good That's for that. That's wonderful.